Hi there, I'm Nate Williams, Territory Customer Support Manager with John Deere. And here with me today is the 560M Baylor. Uh, this is a five by six Baylor, and the zero on it is the Zero Series. So we introduced the Zero Series a few years ago. Uh, obviously, if you're familiar with like the seven series, eight, nine, and then the Zero Series um, here that was introduced. Uh, the M on the end is is that is that standard uh, standard spec. We have we have offerings in in Baylor's in E, M, and R series. So similar to like if you're familiar with the tractors, R series is that premium spec, with some enhanced uh, drives and some components uh, and ISO bus connections. Uh, here with me with with the M that we have here, what you're going to see is the Mega Wide Plus pickup on this Baylor. So this Baylor, um, we've used the Mega Wide Plus pickup for for a number of years. It's proven technology in the industry. And, um, and so that is on this baler today. There are certainly some options uh, that can be added to these machines. So if you get into like a pre-cutter baler where you're wanting to have knives in there to cut up uh, and, and to, to you're not, maybe you're not running in like a TMR mixer and you're wanting to go ahead and cut uh, to make uh, to make bales, pre-cut bales, um, that can be added. And when you get into the pre-cutter balers, you start seeing a lot of other options added as well. So if that's something that's important to you. Um, you can get into the new the new pickup, which is uh, the HC squared pickup, mega wide HC squared pickup. And what that's really doing is giving you a lot of other features added. One of the big ones on that one is a hydraulic drop floor. So if you end up getting a slug or something stuck in there, you can from the cab from an SCV, you can go ahead and drop that floor and clean that out. It's a great Great, great feature. As someone who's ran a few of these balers before in the past, it really helps out a lot uh, to be able to get that cleaned out. Some of the other things that get added as you get into maybe some of that uh, more wet or higher moisture sort of crop, uh, there's a third drive roller added to the top uh, to help on some of those as, as you go up in that. But as you look across uh, this this Zero Series baler, you're going to see a lot of components uh, that we've we've kind of modified and changed and just updated. So we still have uh, like a net system on here. You can certainly run Twine as well. But with this net system, uh, we've got uh, the same system that we've used many years, but just some updates added to it uh, from if you're familiar with the brake on the side um, and just. Uh, the rubber roller, we've made some changes back there to help keep that area clean and make sure that the net's doing what it's supposed to do and not getting uh, wrapped up on this. That's the 560M uh, Baylor. If you have any other questions, uh, go to johndeer.com or see your local dealer.